Mrazi, you see, I've been praying for you people with your wife. Mama, this issue of Satan, what is trying to do on you, don't look at it serious. You must never allow Satan to divide your attention. Yes, Amen. Uh, because there's a grace that God has already given you. you hear me, Mama? Amen, Daddy. Come here. I want these dreams to happen because she's dreaming a lot, this woman. She tells you dreams? Uh, not really. Eh? Not really. She must tell you. You see dreams. Okay. And now she will tell you, she will dream things that will happen. Amen. Uh, dreams. Many of the prophets, they, they prophesy by dreams. Many prophets are prophesied by dreams. Because they see something, they come and say it. They see something and come and say it. They see a service, they come and the other people who are seeing what I'm doing here. So I have to be slow. <laughs> I have to be slow. The other people who are here, who knows what will happen to the service. So I have to be slow. So I want this woman to receive that grace. Amen. In Jesus' name. Oh, Amraz, you are blessed. Hallelujah. So you always dream? Eh? Okay, yeah? Yes, prophet. You are always dreaming? Yes, prophet of God. Yeah. So you dream when we are praying for people here? Yes, prophet That's of why God. That's you came. Yes, prophet of God. It's true. I told my husband. You told your husband? Yes. Is your husband? Yes, prophet of God. There's a grace here. Understand that God has given you, sir. Yes, Apostle. Yes, sir. yes, Apostle. But she's coming from the family of Sangomas. We, true, we, man uh, of God. Uh, true, it's true. And God chose her. True, man of God. Yes. I see Sangomas there. It's true, man of God. Yes, you here, you are chosen. True, man of God. But we must pray for your womb. Yes, man of God, I was praying for that you locate me for it. Oh, God, I give you praise. Oh, thank you, Why Father. Why do you pray for me to locate it? Oh, because, because you have got the grace, man no, of no, God. No, 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 no. I also want to go out here oh, and thank you, bring God. someone to come and work. How do you pray for me? If I don't locate it, it means your prayer is not answered. Oh, thank you, Father eh? God. Why do you give me pressure like this? Oh, yes, Lord. I mean, she, she told you about the womb? Yes, 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 Pastor. She told eh? me. She told me. Oh. Yes. Uh, you have a gift at all. By this woman. Thank you, thank you, thank uh, you. God will use person. you. Eh? Will use you. God will use you. Because can you see the Sangomas there? These are Sangomas here. Yes, yes. And the very serious ones, not just a Sangomas. True, man of God. Uh, but look how God chose you from. Can you see the grace of God? Yes. How can God choose you from serious Sangomas like that? Yes, men of God. Thank you, Father. Come to me. Let me lay my hands on you. You are anointed. Who want cars? None. Hey! 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 Your spirit, come on! Hey! Hey! You people here, you are blessed. I can't see you. Take it. Take it in the name of Jesus. Take it in the name of Jesus. You are blessed. You are blessed. Congratulations. <laughs> Let me... Mama, today when we were here, we heard about a land issue. I want people to have lands. Let me pray for people who want lands here. Run forward. If we... Hey! Hey! Take it! Take it! Take it! Take it! Take it! Take! Take! In the name of Jesus... You are blessed with lens. Uh -huh. You have it. Look at this man here. Hey! Hey! Mm. God bless you. Can you stand up, Ceci? Yes. Stand up. Come to me. I want to pray for you. 
I want you to forget about the past. You understand? Yes. Yes, because when I look at you, I saw disappointment. Yes. And God said to me, I must call you. Jesus. Because in your heart here, you are coming here to say, I want men of God to speak with me. Yes. And uh, this disappointment here, I'm hearing that is cancelled. Amen. You understand? Hey, hey, hey. 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 Don't touch her. Don't touch her. How can you usher a person like this? Please. Uh, Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Viewers all over the world, welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Wednesday live service under the leadership of Apostle JB and Prophetess T. E. Maganemisa. And with me here today is my sister, who was located during the service by the Apostle, who ministered upon her life. Mama, kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. Okay, my name is Prophetess Beatrice. And I'm coming from Karinan. The Apostle located you and ministered upon your life. Please tell us in details what he said to you and please confirm it. Okay, he said to me, I'm seeing a disappointment and um, I must forget about what happened because God is doing something great in my life. And I was married and then I got divorced. Uh, it wasn't something that I wanted, but it's something that happened. So I understood what he was saying, so that I must move on. Uh, I was struggling about the entire thing of divorce. Uh, but today, I know God has set me free. And how did the divorce affect you? Yo, it affected me and my children so much. It affected us because of it wasn't something that I wanted. But uh, I, could, I couldn't force things. So, yeah, it wasn't something that I wanted. So it affected me then, but it, I learned to live with it. So today I'm feeling being set free, I'm free. And how do you feel that today the Apostle located you and even told you to forget of what happened in the past? Yo, I'm feeling so blessed because I came here expecting. I wanted uh, to know what does God say, say about me and about this divorce. So when he told me that uh, I must forget about it, yo, I was so pleased, I was so pleased. And how would you encourage somebody who's going through a divorce and they're watching this? Uh, God, does, God does not love divorce. So I will say, come to Charis Missionary Church, speak to the servant of God if you are uh, thinking of divorce, because divorce is not the will of God. And if you can speak to the man of God, he can be able to pray with you, and you might find yourself uh, restoring your marriage. I want to pray for you. Come. This is a demon here. This is a demon here. This is a demon. This is a demon. This is a demon. This is a demon. This demon must leave you. This demon must leave you now. This demon must leave... Hey, you. Come, come. Come here. This thing must come out of you, Mama. This thing must come out of you. Hey, brother. Come here. Come. Look here. Hey, where now? Mm. 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 Hey, brother. Come. I'm praying for you, my brother. You understand? I'm standing there, but I'm praying for you because you, your coming here is divine. Yes. Yeah, you, you're not supposed to have come here. Thank you. And uh, it's God who brought you here. You understand? Yes, yes, sir. So God said, I must pray for you because I'm looking at the marriage here. Yes. You understand? That devil is fighting. Yes. Huh? And you, you are, you are down. Your spirit is very much down. You are, you are worried. Correct, sir. Uh, you are mm. very much worried. Look at this marriage. Who came with you? With you? I came with Pastor Mlaozi. Eh? Pastor Mlaozi, are you aware of his problem, this man? Let's get the mic to Pastor Mlaozi. Because I'm looking at this man. In my heart, I'm hearing that he's crying. It's true. Correct. Sir. Amen. Correct. Yeah. Is it true what I'm saying, sir? It is true. And that's the reason we came, because he needs divine direction pertaining to what you just uttered about marriage. He lost his wife, I think it's two years back. Yes. So he need direction from God where to go. Where now. to go now. Amen. My brother, I want you to forget about the past. You understand? Go console your heart. Look at this problem. 
Yes, sir. Eh? God will give you someone. Thank you, sir. You must not listen to family. You hear what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Do. Don't listen to family what they're saying. Yes, I do. You understand? Yes, I mean, I'm You God. tell yourself, God will give me someone who will stand with me in church. Thank because, you, sir. You want to serve God. Correct. Uh, you want to serve God. So how do you find someone who's not saving God? Allah Marozi to help you. If Allah Marozi, help this man uh, because he's confused. Also choose for him. Choose this man for it. Mama, help, let's help my brother. Let's help my brother. Uh, what happened to him is not good. Uh, let's help my brother. Mama, as I'm praying with this brother, you, this is your responsibility. Let's take this man as your son. Now, we help this man. Are you hearing that? Yes, this man must have a wife. God bless you. Sir, kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Chililo. I'm from Protea Glen. Sir, today during the service, the apostle located you and he ministered upon your life. Please tell us what he said to you and please confirm it. He just told me that now I'm here. That is the first time to be here, and then he, he said, um, I've got a problem with my wife. My wife has passed away, I'm sure, two years ago. So he said, now it is important for me to have a wife because the ministry won't grow. So I must, I must, I must get a wife, and then the ministry will grow. Amen. Yes, yeah. And so how did losing your wife affect you? Yeah, it is very much disturbing because... Uh, Everything, if you don't have a wife, then it's very, very much uh, difficult for, for the service, for everything which maybe must be done in the church, and then it's very, very much disturbing. I, I think it's, it's important. That's why the Bible says it is important for a man not to be alone. Yeah, it's very, very much important. Yeah. Mm. And so how do you feel that today the Apostle located you and ministered upon your life regarding this issue and even guided you on what to do? I think it's very, very much important because now is what God has said because I, this is what I was looking for because I didn't want to, to, to just do a thing without getting information from God with what must I do from, from now here. Amen. Yes, ma'am. And how do you feel? Uh, I feel great because uh, sometimes things here, it won't come. God will never tell. Even if you're a member of God, God will never tell me. That's why I'm, I'm here. I'm feel, I'm feel great. Okay. Until so, can you just come here, brother? Come, come, come here. <sighs> I want to tell you that these visions you are seeing are real. Don't doubt God. Are you hearing? Amen. Amen. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. Sir, kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. Laksun Yano from Sashangove. Today during the service, the apostle located you and he ministered upon your life. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. I confirm everything that the apostle said when he located me. Even though some of the visions, I can't see them clearly, but I always see visions. Yeah. And how do you feel that today the apostle located you and assured you that the visions that you are seeing are true? No, I, I feel like I'm breaking through. Yeah, I'm feel free. Because I was saying to myself, I can't go back home the same today. So I confirm everything to be true. 